Namaste. I want to tell you about something really exciting. We're starting a new program for the new year, and we call it Sat Sangam, your personal dialogue of self-discovery. What this is, it's an online Zoom video conference, but it's only for subscribers to this channel. So if you enjoy the programming here, if you like the topics that we discuss, then you should definitely participate. It's going to be every Sunday night at 6 p.m. Sri Lankan time. And there's a link in the video description to a handy map that shows the local time in your area. There's also a link to the video conference that you can choose to join the meeting. When I first came up with this idea, I had to think about it for a while because we've had some kind of weird experiences with online things, group things, and so on. Uh, we had a course about a year and a half ago on matrix learning or becoming genius, and we used Discord, and it was kind of discordant. <laughs> but uh, I think the problem was I was only one person, and to moderate everything was too much of a job. I couldn't be in two places at the same time or do two people's jobs. So now I'm going to partner with Richard Clark, who's been on several conversation videos here recently, and he's very knowledgeable and also expert at managing Zoom conferences. So he is going to moderate and actually organize the whole thing. He's going to host it on his uh, channel, which is a paid cloud account. That means the quality of the sound, especially, is going to be a lot better. We won't have the annoying dropouts that we've had in some of the recent conversation and online streaming videos. So it's going to be a really nice experience. We're going to have fun. It's not going to be all serious. I hope we make a lot of new friendships. But actually, when I was first thinking about it, I wanted to call it Captain Dharmasar's Lonely Hearts Club uh, Darshan. <laughs> but unfortunately, uh, Richard wouldn't approve that. He said his wife would consider it derivative, which I guess it is. But then everything is sort of derivative. It's just a matter of degree. But that led to a nice long conversation about the nature of creativity. What does an artist actually do? Because, you know, artists have so many influences, right? And that's actually the meaning of Sat Sangam. Sat means truth. It also means eternity. So the eternal truth is realized by association with good people, people with spiritual values, people who are truthful and honest, people who have integrity. So that's the real meaning of satsangam. It means associating with people of integrity, people that we admire and respect. So this is a really great opportunity to further your spiritual life and to go into topics that give you any kind of trouble, any kind of doubtful or misunderstood feelings, and ask any questions that you want. Bring up any topics that interest you or trouble you, and we can discuss them as a group. I'm not going to be the only one speaking. It's going to be refreshing that I don't have to carry the whole load myself. So I am looking forward to this and to your participation in it. And I'm really happy about this. We're going to start next Sunday, a week from the date this video is posted. And it's going to continue every Sunday thereafter. Uh, we're also going to post a link on some of the daily sutra videos so that more people can find out about it and join it. So I'm looking forward to seeing you there. Please be on time. 
And when you first join, have your video muted so it doesn't cause a disturbance, especially if you're a little late. But you're going to be on time, right? <laughs> so I'm looking forward to seeing you there. Aung Tat Sat. Aung Shakti Aung.